Hey guys, before I get into this video, if you want some cheap and reliable coins, go to fifacoinsfc.com. The link will be in the description down below and use the code DODGE5 for 5% off. Hey guys, what is up? It's Dodgy here and welcome to a new trading method on my channel and this trading method is designed for Team of the Year and you'll be seeing this on Sunday the 11th of December and Team of the Year comes out on Monday the 12th. And you'll be seeing this because I'm going to show you three, that's right, three trading methods which can earn you maybe from 100k to 500k if you do these right. That is guys, honestly these, these methods earned me 300k last year, that's how good they are. And firstly I want to say thank you guys for being patient with me and thank you for keeping your subscriptions, giving me support in this time that I have exams. I know it's not the best time to probably be watching YouTube videos because... Oh well, to be watching me because I've not got that many uploads out, but honestly, as soon as the exams are over, I will be getting double uploads, maybe triple uploads for you guys, if that's what you want to see. Uh, we're doing really well on Inform Silver. We have currently hit the 70k mark, which is insane, guys, in about a week of trading. But let's get into this. So, my first recommendation for you guys in Team of the Year is to invest in your bigger named players. So maybe... 300k plus players these are the best to invest in so yeah uh, your legends your legends are the best to invest in so my what I'm gonna do when I'm gonna buy you guys probably be wondering when are you gonna buy dodgy and I'm gonna buy when the defenders are out and my, my friend hyper he told me to buy when these are out because these are when there's probably going to be most supply into the market people are just going to be going oh look team of the years out let's just burn all our packs and yeah so you think it's when the strikers are out but i think that's when prices are going to be rebounding up and my advice to you guys is keep checking players prices that is your best advice keep checking their prices and making sure they're not going back up and as soon as they start going back up you want to be buying them because you don't want to be missing out on any extra profit you could have had because once you do guys it's so hard for them to go back down and they probably won't go back down and so what I'm gonna be doing I will show you who I'll be investing in I'll be buying a team a very expensive team probably one point maybe two million I'll be investing in this guy Zola Actually, that, I think that's a good deal. <laughs> Quick, for bin. I think that's a good deal. For Zola. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> Quick, I think that's a good deal. I might be wrong. Quick, like. No, it's not. Zola's price has gone down. But I will be definitely investing in Zola and in Zagi. For the Inzaghi? Inzaghi. Whoever. But I will be investing in them too for this squad I've got. And I'll be buying them when the defenders come out. And as soon as I see the prices going back up, I will be smiling like a Cheshire cat. I'll be grinning. Because I know. That's when I know I will be making a lot of profit on these guys. And my second trading method for you guys is to pick up these. Your gold squad fitnesses. And people will be mostly looking to be trading, trying to pick up cheap deals. And this is what you want to be doing. Min price, nothing. Max price, 300 coins. You want to be picking up every single one you can see for 300 coins or less. Try and be winning them for 200 coins if you can't. But if you can't, well, if you can't win them for 200 coins, bid 300 coins because you'll still make a profit. And you want to just store them all in your club. And as you know, you can have unlimited consumables, which is insane. And because of this, you are able to store so many. And if you can pick them up for two, three hundred coins, think about how many you can store. And recently on the Boxing Day Lightning Rounds, I managed to pick up a hundred. Yes, that's right, a hundred squad fitnesses for three hundred coins or less. And that was when packs were coming out. People were going over the transfer market, selling packs, putting them up for cheap. And I was just bidding, blitzing through, picking up so many deals. And I managed to sell them all on for 650. And an average was around 350 coins profit on each card after tax. And we sold 100 of them. So that was 35k just in a day's trading. Which is insane. Just doing that. On, uh, just on top of all my other trading. So that's my other method. And finally my last method is to be investing in these guys. The Republic of Irish players. And this... You want to invest in them because the St. Patrick's Day Cup is around the corner. 
So if you can, guys, try and get your hands on loads of Coleman's, Shane Long's. Make, try and get his inform. That's your best bet. Try and get his inform. McGeady's. But the best thing to invest in is invest in people that you know will go up. Say your goalkeepers, because every squad needs a goalkeeper. You can't play without a goalkeeper. And so who I invested in early doors was Shay Given and Kieran Westwood. So I'll show you Westwood. I don't actually know his price. I've not checked it in a while. So you want to be investing in this guy if he's fairly cheap. Oh my god. He's 10,000 coins? Whoa. How can he so much? So he's going for 10,000 coins. So I would not recommend investing in him now. Wait till team of the year. Make him watch his price go down and buy him. Because look how much I've been picking him up for. I picked him up for 3,600 and he's going for 9,000 coins. Look at that. 3,300. And he's going for so much. Let's check up Shea Given. Not Kevin Gibbs. Shea Given. Let's check his price. I'm sure his price will be rocketing too. Because people will have noticed that squads need goalkeepers. And look, he's gone up to 7k. And your best time... Your best time to be investing, guys, is Team of the Year, because that is when players are guaranteed to go down, because there's going to be too much supply, and we're going to be keeping up with prices, and it's just going to be absolute mayhem. I mean, so many cars will, the market will be flooded with the cars, so people aren't going to be keeping track of these Republic of Irish players. So, my other um, recommendation is to go check out this guy called Garmston, and... Most people would be wanting to play with four at the back, I imagine, so... Uh, that's what I think. Sorry, I'm just adjusting the camera. And he's 12k. I think he's getting price fixed at the minute. So, maybe not the best to invest now, but when it comes to Team of the Year, if he dropped to maybe four or five grand, I would be looking to pick him up. If I have the spare coins left from building my squad, I'll be looking to pick him up. And finally, my last recommendation that I'll be showing you guys is Shane Long's Inform. I mean, he's probably the best player that Republic of Ireland actually have. I'll check how much he's going for. Is he going for about 40k? I think he's going for more. I actually genuinely think he's going for more than 40k. That's just, I don't know who's released a trading method on this, but this is what I'm think is showing you guys. 43k is his lowest buy now. This is insane. He used to be maybe 25,000 coins. And when Team of the Year hits, if he drops to maybe 30k, 25k, you want to be picking this up because people want the best for their squads. If they if they can afford the best, they will buy the best players. And they want to win the St. Patrick's Day Cup. And if they buy the best players, they, they think they can get the best chance of winning it. So they will be looking for, that for the informs especially. This is where your big profit can be made. And also your big profit can be made on silver players. So Sil silver Republic of Ireland players. So maybe your PC ones that uh, you think will go up a lot. So I don't know who fit fat he is. So obviously not Richard Dunn. He's just so slow. But maybe Connor Salmon. He might go up. People might be not looking to use Robbie Keane. But Pilkington, mm, he's a bit suspect. But maybe Murphy, maybe you could invest in him if his price goes down. That's just a suggestion. I probably won't be. I definitely won't be. Read the pace. Okay, so anyway, guys, if you have enjoyed, please smash that like button. Let's try and hit 200 subscribers soon. I think we've smashed 180. And hopefully you guys are enjoying these uploads. And they're helping you. I've showed you three training methods. These should make you a lot of coins. Hopefully it'll make me a lot of coins too. And my name's Dodgy, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.